Mr. Lipinski? Tell him not an expert because it's only three pages. <laughs> okay. So um, if you take the last page first, this is what I wrote, and my daughter is pleading with me just to read what I wrote. So. Go ahead. Okay. And now this is from my own experiences um, and from my um, research. I was an industrial engineer, so quantitative analysis and all that. So um, my comment is that the issue is the Department of Family and Protective Services, which does a wonderful job, I'm not here for money or anything, does not provide the over 200 rural counties in Texas with child placement services for adoption of the abused and battered children in its ward. Now, what I found out is, because I went to a seminar uh, put on by the El Paso office, and if you want to put down two people that are superior, it's uh, Vera Robinson, she's a faith-based specialist, and her uh, superior, who is um, Diana Lopez. Well, um, when we signed up, I decided to adopt, want to adopt kids. <coughs> um, I'm retired, so I have all day, every day. And so anyway, we made out the application. I was about to take their, what they call pride. Um, oh boy, I better go. All right. <laughs> Contracts. In other words, they, they, they contract with CPAs to provide these you know, adoptions. But only currently, and it's nobody's mistake, in the county in which the office is. So if you look at this map, anything in white or light tan, 251,000 square miles and 5 million people, don't have the coverage necessary from the CPA to adopt. So, um, just one more. 17 seconds. Okay. The next chart <laughs> from that report. Uh, this is the flow chart. I was an industrial process engineer. And it shows you from day one to J's 365 what the courts take, right? And at the bottom, you can see it says it also another six months. Well, what I'm recommending is an adoption is way down here, right? <clears throat> what I'm recommending is, is that the department plus the child placement agencies work together so that the CPA person knows the child from day one. I mean, we know all these children want love, right? And there's nobody to blame for it, but as you can see, all the pictures are different. Each child is different. Mr. Pinsky, your time's up, but I'm going to ask that the department staff call you because I think you may be on to something. So. I'm married to one of you engineer guys. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for being here.